So start by placing four blocks of obsidian to the right, and then go down one block. And then place three blocks of obsidian to the right and two blocks down. Then go up and place four blocks of obsidian. And go down, place three blocks. You might want to clear some area. Then continue with two blocks and four blocks. Down one space to the right. Three blocks. Two blocks continuous from the bottom. And then up one space and four blocks. We're going to have three blocks coming out and two blocks connecting it to the beginning. There we go. Now we have our basic outline. We're going to start by digging up a few blocks down so we can like um, make it like underground or something. But still, we're still going to have to fill the floor up with some obsidian. So start by dealing it in whatever template you choose. You can start from the outline and just fill it your way in or start how I did. So for this vault, I am thinking of doing two layers deep now. Because two layers would mean less mining and less wasting my time just for a simple prank. There we go. Now we have, we're just gonna place more obsidian and you might wanna dig like a few 11 layers down and then go up in the middle and place like a floor. I'll tell you why, because that's what I did in like my preview of the building that I've made right now so just keep um keep on mining keep on mining there we go we're just gonna keep on mining there we go so now that we have reached this stage now we have cleared all the grass blocks I think yep there we go did a final little breeze through and now we're just gonna dig out you know, two by two uh, square of blocks up to the bottom, of course. And this is what I wanted you guys to like, you can do it into like a cave or something, but I recommend just doing it like a little hole. Then we have lava. This is where the prank comes in. We're just gonna place some lava, a layer of it, and then, yeah, you can see that. Very painful. Then, yeah, we're just gonna take red concrete for one box then we're gonna place obsidian so it doesn't look like it's a brick type of deal. We still want to make it a little realistic because the person that's um, the bait for this trap is like going to think, oh, she can't trick us. We know the red concrete, if we mine it, we'll go to our secret base that's actually little diamonds. But if they do and they're standing right on top of the red concrete, they're in for a big treat. Well, not for them, but for us because they're gonna die and fall in lava. This is the best one done in survival mode, but not the building part, of course. You can't get all this obsidian in survival, but if you can, we found a really good obsidian cave. Have fun. Okay, so there we go, and just mining a few more blocks, filling up the basic interior. There we go. So now um, we're just going to be replacing the dirt walls with some obsidian because we're not a noob and noobs love dirt. And maybe we're going to mine these obsidian walls later but just in case. There we go, I'm back. And we're just going to place it up there.
So there we go. Now we're done with the walls. Now it looks a little good. And now, yeah. While you're at it, um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell button. It can help me a lot. Thanks. Now just increase the walls. When you were doing the exact same pattern, just increase the walls with more obsidian to make it look taller or just to get a little bit of more, you know, room and make it feel like it's actually a vault. Are you done subscribing? Thanks! There we go, so remember when we just started off putting the obsidian on the grass? Now I have um, increased it by doing this three times. Now it's four layers tall and it makes it feel more like a building. There we go. Now I'm going to search up a barrel. You can use chests if you like, but I think a barrel would kind of look nice. I did use chests in my previous stuff, but don't worry. Chests are not really mandatory, but there you go. So as you used it, uh, as I told you, um, the obsidian walls are probably going to be mining them. So I had a little problem with this if I wanted to like be placing the barrels all over the place or just like for a few levels. Because like you keep mining up there and I still had to like a lot of dirt blocks and I have to mine them later or we get suspicious. There we go. Um, at this time, point of time I realized that I didn't like how it looked outside and I couldn't remove it either. Like from the inside I couldn't remove it from for the outside. And at this point in time I decided not to put it above the second level. So I thought, why don't we just mine those um, barrels up and just start placing some obsidian because it's really annoying to like um, try to do it like there. Just like, you can literally see the barrels from outside if we do it like that. So we're just going to fill it back up with some obsidian. There we go. Now just jump on back in, place our obsidian back there, and there we go. So. For this model, I am using barrels just two layers up, but if you're using chests, of course you can kick it up a notch and make it higher. There we go, it kind of looks like a locker room or something, but this kind of makes it look like a little vault feeling. It's a vault, and they don't even look like barrels anymore. <laughs> like, barrels don't have knobs, do they? I've never seen a real barrel. <laughs> I suggest that you do more barrels because like these barrels of course are going to be empty that's part of the prank because they're like okay this is her diamond vault so I think there's like diamonds in some of the chests and then they just look up the barrels 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 you just look it up look it up and then they fall into the lava so I was thinking um higher lava like they mine it they're like huh we're not falling for that, and they just do that. So I don't want, to, I'm gonna fill it up like to the top or something? Yeah, the top. Just one block above from ground to then I'm on fire. <laughs> there it goes. Now it's straight lava, and I'm gonna put some obsidian, and red concrete. There we go. Now we're officially done. We can, you can also place signs that don't convince the bait, the person that's falling for the trap, to go in the red concrete because like they're like don't red mind the red concrete because it's my secret base and they're like ha real convincing now we're gonna mine the red concrete and they get trapped so just put some non-convincing signs that convince them to go inside filled with diamonds my secret base filled with diamonds emeralds 
and sapphires. Of course, sapphires are not in Minecraft. I'm very sad of that, but still. Don't open my loot barrels because they have diamonds. Intruder. Wait, no, I was gonna put intruder, but then I took it off. Stop intruder. <laughs> I spelled it like a new. Yeah, intruder. There we go. Now I put some signs that are real convincing, you know. Next, I'm gonna put some signs that are sapphires, diamond wall, you can use your um, username for a little roll call name, something for Minecraft, I don't know. Just trying to make some signs that can really convince them. So, yeah, enter. There we go. So I've already done this in another secret base. It's pretty more amazing. I used to fill to a chest. There we go, we're just gonna play some dirt instead of obsidian, just to like synchronize it. Do not enter. I'm gonna put do not enter. Sapphires, diamond wall. And then we're gonna put don't enter Steve I was gonna put Steve and then I knew Steve was not coming today so we're gonna just put Hero Brian because I think Hero Brian may come and I'm thinking it's not two names it's just one entire name They're watching this video feel free to click this video to go to the previous video and feel free to check out my channel thank you for watching bye